Hey guys, this is Michael Yelton here. I am tying on the Predator fly tying vise developed by Kevin Evans and designed right here in Summit County, Colorado. Uh, we're going to tie a little quick, easy, simple fly, but effective. I've caught fish on this fly all over the U.S. It's called the Olive Waltz Worm. Alright guys, I'm going to be using uh, number 16 Hannock 450 BL jig hook and this is a two and a half millimeter tungsten bead copper um, I'm using number eight glow bright thread and just go ahead and start your fly wrap it all the way back and snip your excess um, I'm going to be using 6 eye mono thread for the, or you can, you know, sometimes I'll even use 6X. If you've got an old spool of 6X laying around, you can definitely use that um, for the rib. Just lay it right in there behind. Grab it. Go wrap all the way back. Get there. I'm gonna get a little dubbing wax, and I'm gonna use some olive hair's ear. This is more of a touch dub, you're not, so you don't need a ton of hair's ear, but more of a touch dub because you want this orange thread to bleed bleed through the fly once it gets wet. I'm going to touch dub it on there, get it up tight, and start wrapping. Take my mono. I'm going to counter wrap. So see where I'm going my thread this way? I'm going to go the opposite direction. And then get right in there behind the, the bead. Tie it off. Get in front of it. Get behind it. Get that excess out of there. Get in front of it. Get behind it. Snip it off. I'm going to get my whip finishing tool and I just want to make a hot collar right in there behind the bead. And I usually like to go do two just for added strength. That's it. Real. And then you just kind of clean it up. Real quick, real effective. I've caught fish on this fly. Anywhere there's caddis in the stream, anywhere there's mayflies around, uh, this fly works. Low light conditions, that little hot orange collar. You can see when I take the UV light and hit it, and you see how that, that orange thread bleeds through the olive hair's ear. And once it gets wet, it kind of does that as well. And uh, I think that's what really is the trigger for this fly. But um, great quick pattern. You can tie it in different sizes. That's a 16. You can go up to 14, um, even a 12. So you can fish all shapes and sizes of this fly. Very effective. Caught it all over uh, up in New York, North Carolina, out west. Um, simple and effective. That's how we like it.